Hey guys, sorry from PlayStation Now here, and I know I haven't been dishing out a lot of videos lately. Um, I'm sorry, and I will keep on dishing out more videos sooner and sooner for you guys' entertainment. Um, that's why you guys subscribed to me, and I'm thankful for your subscriptions. So, let's get to it! Yay! Anyway, this is another iPod Touch application review. I'm gonna get more to in-depth PlayStation stuff. This is, in a way, technically PlayStation 3 related, considering it is going over Modern Warfare 2. It is a game guide for Modern Warfare 2, so let's just pop that up right there. Alright, well, um, loads up fairly quickly. There's just the opening screen telling you what it's about, not going to care too much about that. So, controls. And it gives you controls, characters, walkthroughs, and extras right down there at the bottom, so keep that in mind. Controls, if you... These are the 360 controls right here at the top. So this is a multi-platform application, and these are the PS3 controls at the bottom. So if you're too lazy to open up the uh, the little booklet that came with the, the game, even though it takes more effort to download an application than to open up a booklet, then there you go. That's your page. Characters right here. It shows you char uh, game characters, 27 in total. You have an Alejandro Rojas Archer uh, Frost, Foley, Ghost, um, it gives you a little um, intel about them, which is actually really neat. So, if you like playing a game over and over and over again because you think it's like a story, um, which in a way it is, um, then you definitely would love this application because it tells you all the background information on all the characters in the game, um, what the uh, main role in the game is and such. Um, it also gives you weapons and gear, so pistols, machine pistols, shotgun, launchers, assault rifles, submachine guns, light machine guns, sniper rifles, equipment, grenades, miscellaneous items, camouflage gear, and attachments. So obviously you know what these are, um, they're just the standard guns and stuff that you unlock and come with the game. Um, camouflage gear, they go all the way down to woodland camouflage, attachments. Um, akimbo, all the way down to thermal scope, and all that good, delicious stuff that you would um, you would soup up your gun with. Um, right here is the walkthrough. It has pretty much a walkthrough of all the levels. Um, this is the campaign walkthrough, and this is the special ops walkthrough. Um, I really don't do the special ops that much. It's not really the game type I like to play alone. Um, if I do ever have the chance to play online with a few of my friends, and that's what I like to do in my spare time. I also like to play online with Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2, but Special Ops kind of seems more fun the way that you're working as a team. That's why I like mag so much, because you're working as a team, and I don't know, I'm a, I'm a teammate player, yeah! Anyway, so, um, yeah, pretty much just the Act 1, Act 2, Act 3, all the way to the conclusion and plot, plot summary. So, that's pretty much it. Um, and extras. This is my favorite tab out of them all because it gives you something cool that no other Call of Duty application for the iPod Touch gives you, which is game maps. Now, um, I'm not, nope, these didn't get, these, um, this isn't the stimulus package uh, update, even though the stimulus package did already come out for the 360 and not the PS3 yet. I know, sad face. But it will come out soon and hopefully we'll get an update for this thing. So let's just pull up a state because that's my least favorite level. So I'm going to talk about the map, obviously, because that's what I do. So as you see right here, it gives you um, roof access. Let's see if I can read this. Roof access, power station, the long, long way, the gully, the greenhouse, and the entrance. Um, so that's pretty much all it gives you. It just gives you a layout of the map. Um, and it also gives you additional intel for the map, like a state is set out in the state grounds of terrain similar to Call of Duty 4, Modern Warfare, multiplayer maps, Greek, and Overgrown. So, it just gives you some background information on the map, so I'm not sure if that comes in useful, but it's kind of cool to know. Um, obviously, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 took some ideas off Call of Duty Modern Warfare 1, because they're allowed to, so yeah. Um, Xbox 360 achievements, PS3 trophies, laptops, Intel drops, perk... Killstreak awards, accolades, call sign, emblems, and XP bonuses. So let's open up the PSG trophies, considering we don't care about the Xbox trophy. Oh, what's this? We have one more trophy than Xbox? Oh, it's probably platinum. Anyway, so um, back in the saddle. So all these stuff um, gives you how to do it. Let's let that load for a second. So, um, yeah, and also gives you tips on how to get the trophies. That's, yeah, so, you know... Definitely down with the set. Um, laptops and Intel jobs shows you the laptop where it's located. A little picture of it right there. 
Um, that's also cool, good to know. So if you're in the location, you can just look around and see that. Um, let's see, perks. Sorry, I'm just getting over cold. All these perks you can get. Um, you click on them. Shows a little uh, synopsis about them and additional intel. Let's see. Killstreak Wards. You really don't even know about these, but let's open up Chopper Gunner because that's my favorite. Um, so additional intel and pretty much all that stuff about the backgrounds. Call signs. Um, which is the little bars that say like the prestige da -da -da -da, and all that um, cool um, catchphrases that you have next to your name emblems and XP bonuses which is like um, if let's say if you shoot someone before they get a kill streak then you would get a hold on you would get a plus kill yay Kill an enemy who is one kill short of acquiring a kill streak. A reward plus 100 XP bonus points. So this app it really gets in depth. It also shows you the pictures, which is also really cool. I kind of like that a lot. Um, and it gives you everything you need to know about Modern Warfare 2. All right, guys, this has been a iPod Touch app review for Modern Warfare 2. Um, if you like what you see, please subscribe, rate, friend request me, message me, comment on this channel, comment on this video. Eh, just send me love. Alright guys, uh, see ya.